Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Sea of Stars tonight. Uh, last time, we beat the Dweller of Woe, uh, but then we learned that folks weren't completely on the up and up. The other two uh, Solstice Warriors, the older pair, Erlina and uh, Brugaves, I guess? Yeah. Uh, turned out to be shitheads, and they turned on us, and they revived the Dweller of Strife and shit. And, uh, so now everything's kind of bad, and we're back at Brisk here, and it's under attack, and, and whatever. So, we're, we're here to, to save folks, I guess. That's what we're doing. Gotta help people, etc., etc. I don't know how we're gonna do that, necessarily, but let's see what we can do. Swim around. Go for a nice swim. Refreshing swim. Where that, uh, I think these dudes are super weak to magic, right? So let's do some big boy fireballs and shit and see what it does. Yeah, that's 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 a, that's a big boy hit, 430 some. Oh, okay, the lead-in time on that is kind of rough. Thing. Oh wow, that was pretty potent too. Oh right, because our normal attacks when they're powered up count as magic, I guess, right? So that's good. Get the ducks on your own, people are taking care of blah blah blah. There we go. Hey, we're cool, we got a thing. <laughs> a, a free, extremely low tier Helia item. Very generous. Very extremely generous, thank you. Thank you, honey. Um but yeah, okay. We we saved her. It's Good. Good stuff. Let's see what else we got around here now. That's what happens when you live on the coast and something happens that sends a tidal wave your way, I guess. Things end up, uh... Underwater! Or soaked, or, you know, more stuff like that. So, uh, can we not... Can't drop down there? It's not a thing that we can do? think we would be able to do that. Help her out there, but such luck. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Let's go over here. Oh, right. We need to move boxes and shit. That was the whole deal, right? So yeah, we need to bop that down there. I see some enemies up there. Let's go back for a little bit, though. Oh, I can't. Great. <laughs> All right, fine, whatever. Let's just do this. And that dude's kind of barricaded in too. So they, I mean, he's safe. he's fine. Oh, they didn't even give me a chance to do the hook shot bit. Come on. Okay, I am curious about just like a normal magic attack. How much does that do? 200 is pretty impressive. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, so they shoot the thing, it doesn't explode, and it does damage across everybody. Okay. I see, I see. Um, so clearly I don't want it to let it do that. So now I'm curious then. Let's do a, a powered up Moonerang. How much is this gonna do? And it, will it go to the little orb thing there? I guess we'll find out. It does. Oh, that's kind of a problem, actually. Oh, yeah. Now we got one of them out, and the orb is gone, too. Alright, you can do that. That's fine. Oh, that didn't count? Okay, only sun and moon magic, then. Oh, okay. Ah, whatever. <laughs> Should be dead now, anyways. 
Okay, so I guess only sun and moon magic from our actual solstice warriors counts as a as a thing here. Stuck behind this big block that fell. Can you move it? Yeah, sure. There you go, buddy. Mushroom soup. Uh, is that, like, filling up our inventory? Do we need to be worried about that right now? Well, definitely didn't get that uh, tomato club, I guess. Um, so... You know what, let's give that to the lair, and then we'll give this to uh, Zale. And then we've got some extra stuff for to get the cool stuff from the people that we save, you know? So we can do anything to get back to other area there. Alright, might have to circle back around for that, it's fine. way? No. There. Ooh, several of them now. Uh, okay, I kinda wanna get like a super powered moon ring going on here. So we'll go ahead and get that rolling. Definitely, uh... <laughs> Try to manage that a bit. Okay, I... Oh, I don't like that, but alright. See how much this does. Alright, that's, that's kind of at a, a more reasonable distance away, at least. had a somewhat reasonable rhythm to it, too. That did 300. 300 across the board. Pretty not bad. Um, just need to do some work about this, though. 23s only. Oh, wait, actually, uh, no. Uh, she's the only one that can go. Fuck. Alright, well, maybe... 27 will do it. Yeah, good enough. Uh, and you know what? Let's do the mending light stuff first. Party heal, just in case, and we can use the magic for other things. Oh, that does an entire party hit, too, no matter where they are. That kind of sucks. Alright, and then... Well, yeah, that's cool there. I'll just finish this off, anyway. 276. Not a bad hit. Hmm. And we get a level up. Wow, that actually came a little bit faster than I was expecting. That's alright. Um... Okay, our defense is alright, I think. I wouldn't say no to more attack, but I also wouldn't say no to more hip, so... More hip, please. Eight's a pretty good boost. And then, yeah, good good for you, Garl. You didn't do anything in the past few fights, because we didn't swap you back in. Um, let's give you some... Uh, you already, you're already good on hip. You're already triple digits. Let's give you some physical defense again. Sarai, I ah, oh, she needs the fucking health. <laughs> this is still a little bit low on that, so we should might crack 90 with this, right? Yeah, okay, that's better. And then Zale is just barely cracking 90 the way it is, but I want him to have. God, it sucks. It only gives you one mana point. That was two, I might consider, but one is kind of just a. Not great thing, but we could stand to give him some more attack. So 
Alright, we got that taken care of. Oh, we could have just walked around and done it too. Oh, uh, uh, that was apparently, uh, oh, it's the impact crater. Okay. It's not that big. That's not that big of a crater, considering it fucking fell from the sky. Like, fucking... Whatever, man. Yeah, we're the Solstice Warriors. We came back to help, I guess. Big one flew away. It might come back. Oh, it's not coming back. Like, it already did its shit here. It's not coming back. All right, we save what three? Looks like about a dozen folks. That's not bad. Not bad for a day's work, evening's work, whatever. All right, well, we'll let them talk it out amongst themselves. They can decide what the fuck they're gonna do. Cause we got other shit to do. Like, come on, let's let's. Fucking, <laughs> let's go. Hey, clearly some of them need to move on, but yeah, there's too many of them for Lucent. Plus, that town already has its own healing. I mean, isn't Lucent still like super under permanent darkness? Like, I don't know if everybody wants to go there. Yeah, let's, let's ask Mr. Double Eye Patch here. Small island to the northeast. Unclaimed one that's filled with pine trees? Yeah, okay. Yeah, sure. A proper ship. Well, I think all the ships in port here are probably busted. <sighs> Does anybody have a ship? <laughs> After everything that fucking went down here. Does anybody have a ship? No, probably not. Meaning, what? Wait, what? What do you mean? What the, yeah, what the fuck? You got a plan there, Keenison? What the fuck? Oh, yeah, of course, naturally. Yep, that's what I was. Oh my god, that's such a bad plan. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Not happening. Also, the cap's right there, by the way, Yolan. It just, just took off her hat. It's Sarai. <laughs> Come on. Are you fucking serious? Really? Exit stage right? And then, yeah, okay, sure. Incredible. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well, like, how are we gonna get there, though? And also, we don't have whatever the soul stone or, anymore to, to get the thing. Sail the Sea of... Ah, yeah, don't talk about... Don't mention the Sea of Stars. Don't do it. Don't title drop. It's bad news. <laughs> uh Oh, it's cursed, isn't it? Yeah, it's fucking cursed. Like, super cursed. What do you mean it's the easy part? Oh, the coin of undeath the court. No, that, that coin's long gone. We used it. No, it's gone. <laughs> that shit, it's gone. Yeah, mm-hmm, uh-huh. Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> Hike to the peninsula. Okay. Yeah, it's... Uh, I forget his name. Valtrade, that's right. <laughs> Dude, put your shirt back on. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. It's too dangerous for a bunch of... sorta of pirates like you. Yeah, okay. Alright, yeah, you can escort us to the peninsula, but after that, fuck off. <laughs> uh, okay, so is, yeah, Sarai's technically not in our party anymore. Alright, very good. Okay. I mean, can we get some stuff? Almost everything is lost. But, you wanna buy some shit? Hell yeah, I wanna buy some shit. Look at that better sword. A better S word. I've already got that S staff though. And we already technically have the best armor, I suppose. 
Alright, give me the S word, I guess. Yoink, yoink. 13 bucks, like we hardly spent any money. Alright. Isn't there somebody we just kind of left in their little hidey hole, though? Can we go back for him? It goes over this way, right? It's over this way. We climbed up in our... Oh, jeez. Okay, right. Climbed up and around. There's some folks, I guess, that are staying behind and rebuilding Brisk. I mean, good luck. Good luck, first of all. And second of all, well... Yeah, I think they were over there. Oh, we just didn't move the box out the way. That was the deal. Oops. So we could have gotten another... No oh, goodness, could have gotten another free, like, low-level food stuff out the deal. But we didn't, because I forgot that we had the ability to move boxes. But, it's not like it probably would have been worth it anyways, so... Let's go back over here and then move this out the way and be like, Yeah, hey, we did it! And, okay, well, I guess it doesn't matter. Alright, so is there anything more to do around here before we shove off? I mean, aside from maybe just save to be careful. Yeah, okay, that dude's staying, whatever. Do some shopping and go back to Wraith Island real quick if you like. Oh yeah, real quick, I'm sure that's just like a 10 minute sale. Nope. Alright, we got a better food stuffs. Okay, that dude's coming along. Very good. Okay, I guess we'll... Well, I thought we would talk to the cap before we uh, shoved off here. Ready to leave? No. Okay, that's the actual leave, though. Yeah. Alright, no. Save first. Save first and then leave. Like a good adventure, right? Yeah, let's go. Ah, oh, that's fast. We're at the peninsula already. <laughs> 26 elixirs. That's a lot of elixirs, but that is very, you know, adventure gamey trope. You save that for, for serious shit, right? Good. <laughs> He's just like, ah, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, the village is safe until we get back, yada yada yada. Going to this weird haunted ship and we don't have that coin anymore to do the thing. I'm secretly Sarai. Yeah, we knew that already. Like, come on. Like, that's not a surprise. <laughs> yeah, wow. Incredible. Couldn't tell at all. What a masterful disguise. Yeah, we knew. Yeah, okay, okay, Valer, there we go. Get, what, what do you mean? What fucking? I didn't see anything. We figured you had a good thing going there. We're not gonna. We're not gonna fucking rat you out. Yeah. So about that coin, we no longer have. <laughs> so how we uh, how are we gonna get this? Cursed ass haunted ghost ship without the fucking coin that we don't have now. Here we go. So, how are we gonna get aboard this ship, by the way? Are we just gonna jump in and fucking swim for it? That seems like a bad plan. Seems like an extraordinarily bad plan. Oh, but we did it, apparently. Or no, we did we jump onto it? Wait, wait what the fuck? All right. <clears throat> sea of nightmare. Any second, get off right now. Hell no. We just got on. We ain't getting on. Oh, well, all right. Well, okay. We're dead. <laughs> well, 
more or less. These are our death poses after all. Oh no, Garl's fine. It's whatever. I've had worse. I almost nearly literally died. Do you think this is gonna scare me? <laughs> sea of Nightmare, you say, huh? Binding your souls to an ancient pirate curse. Ah, eh, curses don't exist, whatever. Plan on claiming the ship for ourselves. Uh-huh. How do we plan on doing them? That's a good question. I wish I knew. How are we doing this? It so? Like, Garl, you gotta stop trotting our titles around like you fucking think it means something. Solstice magic. No creature is immune to it. Okay. Alright. So something's... Something's clearly going... Like, this you know, supposedly, probably clinically insane pirate ghost is just like, whatever. <laughs> like, maybe we can help each other out. The navigator, huh? Portents. Right, right, right. Oh no, it wasn't her that went wild, it was, um, their wind mage, right? He was just like, ah, fuck, I ain't doing whatever, and he's just like, we're gonna stay out here until everybody's dead, and so it happened. <clears throat> okay, Stormcaller, okay. I guess we're gonna go fight a fucking thunderstorm. Well, it gives up, or I let the Vespertine sink. By the looks of it, neither is happening anytime soon. Well, first of all, don't let it sink. We're kind of here for the ship itself, and if it sinks, that's no good. Um, so let's go beat the shit out of Storm... Storm... Chaser? Storm Call. Storm Call. Hey, game over. How you doing? I'll see ya. Beat a grudge so strong it magic the parallel nightmare realm in which to torture a group all the Damn, when you put it that way, that seems like kind of not a good plan. Wind barrier, huh? How do we do that? Three lightning rods. Okay. Destroy the lightning rods. Got it. ways up. Well, presumably it's the direction opposite the direction that the rain has fallen. Kitchen past crew quarters, get a map, blah 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 blah. Got it. Understood. Oh, so now Sarai's back in her party, sort of. Carl's also here. Um, yeah, what's her equipment looking like? Okay, Carl's got the, go the cool shit. He's also got the thing which would what which does plus fifteen percent to undead, which I think is gonna be important yet. Alright, well oh gee, whoa, did that actually cause damage? No, it didn't. It just kinda spooked me a bit. Got it. Oh, yeah, we can climb that stuff. Alright. So a little explorer gonna do us good here. Or maybe this was secretly like where we were supposed to go to begin with, right? Oh, well, maybe not. Okay. Is that funny customer down there? Oh, that's an enemy. Alright, got it. Ooh, that is a hell of an enemy. Okay. Uh... Uh, Sarai, I need you for this one. So let's do that. Bunch of venom shit. Okay, pretty good. Pretty good. And then, uh, the lair. Need you to do some moon shit here, too. Break the one out of its, uh... Oh, okay, that one's pretty much instant. I guess it's a gun, right? 20, perfect. 
Oh, all right. That's okay. That's a rough read. Uh, actually, wait. Uh, Zaley's got an attack, right? 48's not bad, but he's still got gun twirling going on here. Oh, it's just that. Oh, damn. Okay. Uh, apparently vulnerable to blunt damage. Oh, God. <laughs> Either way, we're probably looking at some damage about to happen. Oh, wow. All right. Never mind. Should have maybe held out for the party heal there instead. Oh, looks like we had to do that anyway. All right. Just no progress. Better than no progress at all. What's the Chandra do? Oh, just eight mips. I don't really care about that, do I? Wait, was that uh, everybody recovers? Oh no, somebody recovers 90. 90 hits. That's pretty good. Alright, uh. Give, uh, wait. Let's give that to Blair there, and then we can pick up a super good heal. Logbook. I'm waiting to see a save point around here somewhere, huh? Fish pie. Alright, fine, let's give the, uh, Chaudre to Blair. Grab the fish pie. Oh, hey, that would have been a good secret secret back here. Such luck, though. was it that was hitting their vulnerability here? Because I couldn't quite figure that out. It wasn't that. Oh, jeez. Okay, I guess it's just normal-ass blunt damage sometimes. There we go. Or... <laughs> that's that's hard to tell. Cause that didn't trigger vulnerability there. That did though. It's weird. Oh bonk! Oh, sorry. I have a have a little map. That's fine. Kind of a rough attack, though. 30 some if you don't block it. Jeez. It's lots of lots of healing bits here, I guess, huh? Hey, am I going? How you doing? Good to see ya. Good to see ya. Alright, so okay, so clearly they don't want me going in that door. But I do want to attack those fuckers up here. Bonk, eat shit. Because good XP is good XP, you know? Oh, wow. Got lots of... Lots of stuff happening here. Um, Alright, Sarai, you go first. Oh, well... That was kind of bogus. Alright, I guess, uh... <laughs> Valeria, you're next to at least these dudes down a little bit. I'm 
I'm pretty good. All right. Uh, what are you doing there? Soul rent? That doesn't sound good. What is that doing? Oh, geez, 39. That's what that's doing. That's a pretty easy read, though. Okay. Just up to your attack, so this should be good. Oh, 21? Maybe not. Crap, I do. Ah, oh, he goes after the dude who's gonna take a nap. Great. Fuck. <laughs> Dad, yeah, crap. Alright, we'll take one of those. Okay, 38's enough, thank you. Nine is not enough, but should have. Okay, that's good. I'm supposed to work on some dude's feet. Let's do it. Ah, I get it. I fucking get it. Good play, though. Good play. Oh man, we can't carry that. What does the Hardy Stu do? It's like 90, 90 hips. That's a, that's a lot of hips. Um, okay, let's do the party heal for 40. Like, no, I bet if you, like, if you were needed to do a VPN thing, I bet you'd get it done in the expected amount of time with which such a task takes to get done. Oh my goodness, look at all that poison. All right, uh, Sarai, we're gonna hope that you do a thing here. Oh, oh my god, I fucked it up. All right, great. Okay, at least we get enough distance here to do the moon ring. Mid 40s all around, not bad. Okay, good read. No, oh, stop attacking Zale. Fuck you. Oh boy, don't attack him a third time. Okay, thank you. You have a good sense to get out of the way of that either. All right, 27. Can we do 27 on this? Nope, 21s. 21s only, apparently. Um, okay. It's not even enough, huh? Now, well, one of them's gonna die. This one's gonna die. Okay. Attack the correct person. Oh, jeez. Whoa, okay. Dude, the normal attack does 38. Come on. The fuck? Oh, I should do a party deal here, huh? Yeah. Let's do a party again. Uh, this will do 90 plus. Oh, or a fucking smooth even hundo across the board. Pretty not bad. 37 is pretty good. Too bad I fucked up the combo. Alright. And there's our save point. Okay. There's the save point plus the the free heals and shit. See, good design. We're never that far away from a from a heal and a save. Yeah, we got a map. Let's go back to Hortons after we heal and save. Just have ourselves a quick snooze on this haunted ass pirate ship, no problem. Definitely where I get my best sleep. Couldn't be any worse than the sleep I already get, I suppose. Uh, okay. I think we're good. Let's go talk to Hortense. Yeah, hey. I found your map, by the way. Here. <laughs> Starting to give you hope. Oh, I don't like giving people hope. That's how, that's how you get disappointment. You start giving people hope, and then you're you're opening them up to disappointment. Don't do that. 
Connects to the sea should allow you to get an idea of the place. Okay. I should take the wheel and certainly use a brick. Yeah, sure. Fucking steer a pirate ship. Three islands, one rod each. Once they're out, we can storm Maelstrom Point and take the fight to Storm Caller. Hell yeah. Hold X to move forward. Oh, it's tank controls. Yeah, I love tank controls on a boat. Oh, that is definitely... Yeah, that's tank controls. Not not like the cool tank controls, though, with the individual tread forward and back, but kind of the shitty tank controls where you get aim and forward. Also, I don't know where our boat went when we uh, docked at the port there. It just kind of disappeared. Oh, I mean, gives us a fucking... Didn't we just heal? We did. I'll put Garl back in the mix here until we need Sarai's poison again. Alright, turn this shit off. Smash those crystals, hell yeah! Yeah, how do we... Can we, not, can we grapple up, or...? Hmm, alright. Ah, uh, but first... But first, we must solve the puzzles. Never not do a puzzle solve. Also, we move this box over here. Is that correct? I guess that's correct. Has to be correct. We can't do anything else about it. Oh, I see a coin up there, though. What's that? Hmm. I would like whatever that is, I think. Oh, yeah, there. Oh, hey, I get it. We fucking... Rustled the trees jimmy so hard, the coin fell down. I figured there would be a fight here. Oh, uh, ah, of course there's more than one. Um, well, this is actually kind of good. Um... We got sun and shit, but we can't... Uh, we're not gonna be able to hit them all. Got no combo points for like the solar rain shit, which would be real awesome, but alright. Can we Okay, we can do like a center bit with a slightly big boy fireball. Hmm, pretty good. Mm, we don't really have much of anything else though. Oh, 38. Oh, fuck. Five there. Okay, there's the moon stuff does it, that I was afraid of. Okay, uh, can we just get him off the field here? Like, we should be able to do 20 with Zale, right? Or Garl is probably guaranteed 20, right? Yeah! Oh boy, okay. Not a damage point was wasted there. Mmm, alright, I guess we've got a party heal coming. Oh, well, we fucked up the combo, but it's mostly healed anyway. Whatever. himself to get that back anyway. There we go. 71's a pretty good, like, individual deal. Okay. Second 
weird coin thing. It's gotta be like that. Okay, sorry, cursed doubloon. You know it's cursed because it's green. Uh, did we want to jump down there? I don't know if we wanted to jump down there. It's either that or probably jump down over here, right? Anything necessarily? Okay, there's another one. Can we climb up there? No. Oh, well, gotta get one of these anyways. Yoink! And, alright, okay. Uh, moon and crush and shit. Uh, we don't have a. Th well, actually, do we have a thing? Yeah, we've got one of these, but we can't hit them both, naturally, because they're can spread out. Alright, girl, let's just get this guy at the fucking queue. 64 is pretty good. Nice hit. Oh, oh for 19. Oh no. Ow! 34 is pretty not good. Uh, actually, no. Uh, Zale, you need the MIPS back more than anybody, right? For your big boy fireballs and such. Okay, good. Then we can get Garl to just put this away. 24. Okay. Be sure of it. Nice, okay. One shot Zale, that's what we call him. 61's pretty good. Ah, uh, what is it? Moon and Slash? Get out of here. Okay. Yeah, he'll do 11 plus 60 is what he'll do. Good job, Garl. Did it. Yeah, save point fit. We don't want to do that, though. Until we get probably all the cursed doubloons, right? That's the, that's the deal I'm feeling here. Oh, oh, okay. I guess that tracks. That over here. Uh, drop down. Yeah, okay. That's what six, five. Huh? Five. All right. Is that enough? Or there's probably six. Like if it's not three, it's gonna be six, right? Oh, well, I guess five is a pretty good adventure number too, right? It's generally not two. Two is too low. Three is usually the the one you depend on. Four is too even of a number to be an adventure number. The next closest one is five. But then six is also pretty reasonable too. But anything above that is kind of like, yeah, that's too many things to, to make an adventure out of, right? Oh, oh shit, there's a fourth one. That figures. Um, alright. Let's see. Zale, I'm gonna have you do this. So then either Garl or uh, Valer can take care of this. Garl can have you do it. Have you feel like you're important? And he is pretty important. He's like he's a pretty good heavy hitter. I ain't gonna cast aspersions at Garl. He's been a pretty good support. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, Valer's the one doing it. Never mind. 
35 is kind of subpar. I would have expected a bit more than that. Oh, and naturally I took the magic off the field, so that's good. That's only gonna do like 17 at best, right? And 14 if we block. Why don't they just do their normal- their normal attacks do a fucking multiple of their dumb magic attacks here. We're not ready for a combo yet, are we? Not ready for the party heal. Now we are. Ready for that sick 100 even fucking heal across everybody. Oh yeah. It's good seeing triple digits. Um, oh that did eat uh, Zeal's attack there. Nice! <laughs> Kinda wanted Zeal to do the big boy fireball to just end this out, but it might just be more prudent to fight this the normal way. Two's pretty fucking solid. Alright, Garl, can you put this away for 62? Yeah, you can, right, nice. Okay, that is six. Count them. Six cursed doubloons. That's probably all the doubloons we need here, right? See if that's actually the case. How do we how do we use them? Oh yeah yeah here. Here, have one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, perfect. That lowers the shit, right? So we can destroy them. Or raises a platform so we can also destroy them, you know, either way. Important bit being that we can destroy them. That was a pretty good puzzle, though. Like, I won't, I won't complain about it. That was, that was fun. We did some battles, we did some puzzly bits, and then we can destroy the lightning rod. The magic lightning rod. Two more to go. What are we doing for health and shit? Eh, could stand to heal, I guess. Get foe out of here. Go to the next one. Oh, let's see, there we go. Sea of Nightmare. Three lightning rods, roughly equilateral triangle. Yeah, that tracks. There's your adventure game. Didn't have a pirate ship with tank controls on my bingo card, though, for this adventure game. But hey, you know, it works out, I guess. Alright, and yeah, blah, blah, blah. I can probably use the blah, blah to get him. Yeah, we probably can. It's just straight up fight shit and destroy crystals, it looks like. Uh, what do we got? Okay. Uh, moons and venoms and shit. Okay. Uh, sorry, Garl. We need a Sarai back for this. It's hard to get going with her little knife throw thing here. But once you do, it's not bad. Okay. Not bad. 
And then moons, do we even need to worry about moons here? Can we just wipe them off the field to begin with? 35. Ah, nuts, no, okay, probably should have. Oh well, let's see what a 60% soul red does, 25. <laughs> And that's a sun... Come on, really? Gross. 49, pretty good strength. But it's just gonna be a bubble drop anyways, which is... What, 14? 14 on a guard, right? Oh, 10? <laughs> just have better M death. Pretty much just healed that back right away anyways because of her lifesteal. I love it. up yet so we can get there nice all right accidentally pick the correct first one let's go this way just to be contrarian though oh another switch very good either way we couldn't have gone wrong no matter what direction we picked i guess that's good design actually um all right so you got ugh, really do we have a thing that does this does Zale have a thing that does both? No. No, he does not. Boy, they really fucking matched those perfectly, didn't they? We can't do any of it, regardless of which attack we use. Well, I don't think it matters. Bubble drop for low teens. Woo! Actually, probably more interested in doing a... You know what? Fuck it. Let's do a slightly bigger boy fireball to... Oh, that one's just out of range, huh? Alright, never mind. Let's not do that. Changed my mind. Yeah, 13. I guess uh, Zale's got the least amount of M death. Takes 14. Oh god, that, that one's hard to read. That's a quick one too. Actually, let's get Garl back in here. He's kind of a known quantity for a physical attack. I think with at least two power, he can take that 70 out and heal. Nice, there we go. Okay. And here we are with this. Uh, need Zail with a sun bit. Beautiful. And then Valer with a actually well timed attack. Excellent. And then Garl, I guess you can just do Garl things, right? Also good. Huh? Okay. Uh, we don't quite have actual combo, so... 39. Zale, are you gonna do 39 on this? That would be the best. No, 32 is okay, too. Like, that, that'll be a... Oh, well. Maybe I should have done both. Well. Either way, we're gonna party heal. It'll be fine. Ah. What do we got? 40? Yeah, alright, Carl, you got this guy for 40, right? Yeah, whatever, <laughs> 70, fuck. Alright, and then party heal, and it'll be like nothing ever happened. Oh, well. Oh, we still healed the full. It's fine. <laughs> and then 7. See, you got this for 7, right? Yeah, no problem. That one, and then we do that one. That's three, four, okay. 
can get a free heal over there if we need it, which we do not. Everybody's back to full. I do like that they give you a, a more or less free way to get your MIPS back during a battle. That's the good shit. That's the real good shit. You're not wasting ethers or elixirs or whatever the fuck. Instead, you're just doing normal normal attacks to do the needful, right? Okay, uh, I need Scry back here. Oh, well, fuck that one up. Good job. Is around, that's fine. Ah. Mm. Come on. Yeah, how much we got there? 32. Uh, I do wish I could look at stats for our characters during battle so I could determine who is good enough to take 32 off of that one. I think Garl would be. Garl would be the easy choice. I guess for now we can take this dude out the queue. 61 is pretty fucking good too. Let's get Garl in here to do 32 presumably on a normal attack. He's got this, right? Oh no, really? Ah, nuts. Alright, whatever. He'll eat the soul rend like a champ, though. Should probably bring Sarai back for the party heal, though. Eh. Should be the last one, right? Okay. One more lightning rod, then we can get to the actual big bad. Well, the big bad of this section, anyways, before we get to take control of the ghost ship. Because, you know, if you're looking for a ship, you may as well take a ghost one. Why not? I guess we'll do a quickie heal before we move on to... Let's get uh, Garl back in there, too. Do they, um... Actually, do they let me? They don't. Okay, so we've got... Valer and Zale are our permanent chronos here, aren't they? So we cannot swap out either of them. That's interesting. I don't particularly like permanent party members like that, but yeah, I guess it makes sense. They're the fucking pro tags, right? And watch, I'll probably eat my words later. Something will happen such that they'll let me swap out those two for somebody else later on, right? That would just be the thing. That would be a very Chrono Trigger thing to do, wouldn't it? <laughs> Which hey, there's plenty of nods to many a good RPG here. I'm I'm cool with that. Like if they want to pull that shit, I ain't even gonna complain. We just saved. Shit, we don't need to do that again. Climb up there. Oh, that's a drop down. It's not bad. See, this would have been a good spot for a secrety secret, I think, down here. Like a. 
like a mildly underwater chest or something. Would have been a good place to hide one. Doesn't seem to be a thing here though. It would have been a good spot, because here we are focused on destroying lightning rods and shit. It's like, oh yeah, these guys probably don't expect to fucking find a chest or whatever. And it's like, no, I would have, would have been ready for it. Hell yeah, I could consult on spots for secrety secrets and probably make some good coin doing that. Oh god, look at this. Poison and normal shit. I don't like that. I don't like those divisions, but, uh... Go ahead and get Sarai in here to take care of this, maybe. That one's almost a little bit easier to maintain once you get it started. Because it's not any different for distance between enemies and you. Like, uh, Valer's Moonerang thing. Uh, did we not have a... Oh, I didn't get a chance to get some extra magic on the field, did I? Alright, fine. Either take one entirely out, or... take a full force soul rend. Eh, I guess we'll do that. They took all that UI off the board while we're doing this. Alright, what's a full ass soul run do? Whoa! Full ass unblocked! 60! That's uh That's fucking strong. I don't like it. Sail, uh, can we? Oh yeah, that thing's going down regardless. So if we're gonna do that, let's just go ahead and get the uh, fucking sort of big boy fireball involved. Nice double kill. Rise taking a nap. Uh, can we? Oh, no, we can't, because we can't uh, put Sarai active until she's no longer KO'd, right? <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, my goodness. 59's a pretty strong go. Zale, you've been working out, buddy? Considering we're getting like 1300 XP per battle here, though, we're. It'll level up sooner than later. Okay, let's see, this would be a good spot for a secret secret, too, but I don't see any chests and shit down there that's worth exploring. Oh, no, no, no! He didn't even let me do the thing! Hey, whatever. Okay, uh, you know what, Sarai, I'm gonna give you this one. Six, pretty good. Um, Zale, can you do a big boy? No, that costs eight. Ugh, hate it. Alright, um, hmm. It's gonna be a problem no matter how you fucking slice it, I think. 52 is pretty good, though. Ugh. There we go. Bop, bop. Double tap. Um, we're not good for... Not good for a party heal just yet, though. Oh, jeez. Wow. Um, gonna regret this, I think. Yeesh. We're gonna need, like, two pretty good things going here. So let's go ahead and do... We'll give one to Sarai. That guy's gonna fucking die no matter what.
Oh, what? I don't know why that third one is so shitty. Always such a shitty thing to try to maintain on the third throw there. Oh well. This is just bad. Or we could just murder him. That's cool, too. I was expecting at least one to survive. And Sarai to probably eat shit for a bit, but... Alright. So I won't complain about it. Um, okay. One there. One there. There. Okay, this one's kind of like an all-or-nothing type shit, right? You did the climb, now you get to fucking destroy them all at once and it feels good. There we go. Alright, we have dispersed the, the wind barrier by destroying a bunch of lightning rods, because that makes sense. Uh, oh, looks like the enemies are back, huh? Yeah, I could deal with, uh, one, one, probably one battle down there and we'll have another level up. Hell yeah. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Be anything of any particular danger here. I think we're good to go. Poison and moon, yeah, figures. Alright, uh, why don't you do a slightly big boy fireball into these three, huh? Geno beam ass charging power thing. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. We're in tr trouble, probably. If they knock out both Valer and uh, Sarai, we're in trouble, but. We're probably good otherwise. Yeah, I knew Valera was gonna probably eat it. Oh, th okay, this could be trouble. <laughs> Alright, luckily it's just this one that's charging up its shit. Get that off the field. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, good thing we caught at least one of those. <laughs> We might be good on the on the remainder here, actually. Okay, good. There's one get the fuck out of here type shit. 58. Damn. Okay. I really don't understand what the vulnerability is here. 60. Okay. You know what? That's fine. Ah. Okay. We need one more battle for the level up then. Should probably get Garl in there instead of Sarai then. Is there gonna be one more? One more quickie battle we can do, so we're ready for this? That would be ideal. Wait, how the hell do we get back down there? Can we just jump down? Okay, good. Come on, don't be doing this. Don't be, like, teasing us with a... a possible fucking level up, and then we're just one battle short before we go and fight the big bad here. Come on, really? That's exactly what they're gonna do. Oh, I hate it. Alright, let's have a look around before we do this, actually. Okay, we just need one battle. Like, even if it's two dudes, two dudes would give us the level up. It doesn't even need to be a big ass battle. But now it looks like we've got nothing else here. Fuck. All right, fine. Whatever. Maybe they'll give us a fight once we get to the main islands. They'll give us one non-boss-ass fight. 
and then we'll be good. Seems unlikely, though. Although this might be a, a dungeon in and of itself, right? Let's see what we got. I doubt they would just pop the boss right at the start, would they? Doesn't seem like a thing they would do. Mm. Then again, they put a fucking heal and probably a save point up there too. So maybe it is like a fucking. Congrats, you did some minor amount of platforming and then boss fight type shit, right? <sighs> that kind of annoys me. <laughs> yeah, let's see, look at this. Yeah, mm hmm. It does seem like they frown upon you grinding for levels, though. Like, I suppose you could go in and out of, uh, like, the overworld spots to do it, but it feels like that's not the thing you're supposed to do. Which I can appreciate. Like, I, I can get behind the notion of if you're fucking stuck forever, just grind so you're super powerful and you can fucking fix anything, but I appreciate the good design that doesn't require you to do that better, I think. Yeah, look at this. Let me use this fucker. Oh, okay. He's got the, the super pirate beard going on. The Vespertine. Yeah, like, well, well, what's the boat actually called, though? I thought it was just called the Vespertine. <clears throat> Storm caller, sea of nightmare, blah, 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 blah. If you try your luck, make sure your aim is true. I mean, we don't have any projectiles, necessarily, unless you count the weird moon boomerang as a projectile. I don't necessarily call it that, but... Whatever. Alright, I guess we're just fucking straight up in the boss fight. Very good. Um... Carl, why don't you start off see what we're dealing with here? Oh, okay, he's got the quick two-tap there. Got it. I dig the fucking pirate ass accordion going on too. Alright, what do you got there? Poison. Ah. Uh, hold on a second. Is Sarai's thing. She's knives, right? She's knives. Slash, whatever. Okay, so let's give you one and go for it. Okay, and then uh, the Blair. You're the blunt attacker there. Okay, take him out the queue. Good job. Do we have... We got three on the board. All right. Guess what, Zale? Big boy fireball. Do it. Hundred and four. You like to see the trip digits. Oh. That's a lot of fucking... Moons and slashes. I don't think we're getting all of those out of there. Only all the moons, though. Nine is not unreasonable. Oh, and he's still gonna get 100% power regardless of what we do, huh? That seems kind of dumb. Why fucking even tease us with that? Whoa, he just fucking jumped! Alright, see ya, buddy. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, good fucking read on that. We got two of the three. Alright, well, time for a party heal. <laughs> that was a pretty sick attack, though. Wow. Pretty sick attack. I will I will give him that one, for sure. Uh, it looks like we're not going to avoid it again, but we can at least... Well, I mean, if we're not even going to fucking get it done, like, we shouldn't even waste our mips, right? So, alright, Garl, you get in there, you do some stuff. And then, uh, Valer, you can do some additional stuffs. And... Still gonna be 100% power no matter what we do, right? Okay, it's like a even three tap, right? Okay. 
Okay, we only got one of them there. Jeez, 70s across the board is pretty not super good. So, uh, we need another <laughs> party heal. Please undo the bullshit that was that. Okay, good enough. And, uh, Zale, are you ready for a big boy fireball? No, we need eight. Ah, fine. At least give Garl maybe one of these, huh? 47's pretty good. Just like a single ass attack, right? Alright, now we're ready for a big boy fireball. We still can't do whatever that is, so... Just do some damage, right? Hopefully Garl survives this. Eighty-three only. I was expecting trip digits. Zale, you're fucking slacking, buddy. Okay. An important bit is that we survived. We don't have a party heal ready for this, though. That makes me unhappy. Gotta get a party heal sooner rather than later. Oh no, look at that. What is that? Uh, crap a dude. Uh, okay. We need Sarai in here, I think. <laughs> the best she's gonna be able to do is two slash and a poison here, so, uh, do that. 74%. Okay, whatever attack that is is gonna chain. Oh, chain lightning. Why do you get chain lightning? Ouch! Oh, but everybody survived. It's fine. Um, can we get Garl back? No, we can't get Garl back in there. There we go. Everybody's fine. What we got there now. S slashies and whatever. We can do... I'm not going to be able to do most of that. Um, okay. Let's get Garl back in again. And... Have him do... Yeah, just gathering into two there. I am kind of curious, though. If we do... Oh, we can't do a combo. We don't have enough for a combo. That fucking sucks. Alright. Uh, Zale... You can do one of these. There we go. Get him down to 65%. Maybe that'll make Garl survive, right? Oh, okay, yep. All right. Because now he's got enough for, like, an individual heal, and he'll be fine. Shit. Still can't do anything about that. Okay, fine. Whatever. Um, we'll need you to do an individual heal on yourself here, though, to survive this. 79's pretty good. I don't think you survive. Now we've got enough for uh, a big boy fireball here. As long as we get one block in there, that's fine. Okay, and then Valer, you're the one left, so that's good. Let's get a party heal. Okay, good enough. More or less. And then... Fully powered big boy fireball. One oh four, there you go. That's what I like to see. Okay, one block out of that. 
we have here? Lunar Shield? Eh, I guess Lunar Shield wouldn't be a bad idea. Defend against one attack, right? Oh, and a minor heal across the board, okay. I guess we're saved from one, so that's fine. Uh, Zale, we need you to do... We need you to get your big boy fireball stuff back, I suppose. As long as we guard one. Guard one in addition to the free hit that we're gonna get here. Okay, well, that was much better uh, than the lunar stuff that was guarding us. Alright, what do we got there? Poison and... Jeez. Never completely clear it, can we? Alright, that's okay. We can make this work with Sarai, I think. Uh, we're gonna need at least one more on Zale to get his... Fireball stuff back. Give her one. Although, technically, I think I can clear this with a one pip combo from. Uh... Yeah. You know what? Let's do that. Nice. All right. It's a little bit more to work with. Okay, two on the field there. That's fine. Oh, and he fucking ate shit there. Nice job. There wasn't a, like a little drawn out, oh, I'm dead type thing. That was a fun fight. I like that one. That was very good. Um, all right. Let's see. See what we got then. Tempted to do magic attack, because I don't think we've done any of that before. Well, let's see. Her moonering is what, seven? Extra bit there to do a double would be okay. But probably more I'm interested in the physical attack anyway. She's at 50 base physical. Same here. Physical attacks all the round, I think. Garl is still the big heavy hitter, though. Yeah, physical attacks all the way around. Zale's kind of slacking there. Oh, we don't even get a fucking physical for him. But giving him more hips is probably good, too. He joins the three-digit club. <laughs> no, I don't know how I'm talking. I fell over the cliff. I mean, we did it, quote unquote. If there's not a phase two, there's gotta be a phase two to this, right? Like, come on. Like, it was a fun fight and all, but it felt like we had too much of a good handle on it. There has to be a phase two. Or we go back to normal dimension, right? That makes sense, too. And now we've got a normal-ass ship. What about the pirate navigator Hortense here? What's gonna happen to her? Is she gonna join our party? That would be cool. Super cool if she joined our party. Eh? Eh? Come on, join our party. Please. Like, I'd love to have a ghost pirate lady on our party. Hey, man, I'm breaking forever, but there's still these people we need to help. Uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. Yeah, I'm sure that people would be happy to be helped by a ghost pirate lady, right? Nobody's gonna take issue with a uh, ghost pirate lady. Oh, see? They're already rebuilding! Look at this! Look at this fucking town! Wow, they are very fucking industrious, aren't they? All oh, right, forgot Teeks is with us too.
Teeks is fun. Teeks is a good character. She's going to be your navigator. Oh, she's okay, so Hortense is sticking around. That's neat. I figured it was like some soul bond type thing, like, oh, the curse is lifted, I can finally pass on or whatever, right? <laughs> oh, no, okay, so not only is Cat and Cliche actually Soraya, but there's something else to her, huh? Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay, uh-huh, uh-huh. Pulling you out of actual hell. <laughs> That's what we do around here, I guess. We save ghosts from hell. But hey, we did it. So now the fucking pirate tropes live on. Quite the mandolin player. <gasps> Is our natural fucking in-game jukebox gonna gain a fucking mandolin? That would be fucking great. That's super cool, if true. Ah, oh, fucking sick! <laughs> Ah, uh, it's fun. I love it. Incredible. Incredible all the way around. I like it. Alright, we did it. We've discussed things with the villagers, presumably, and now we can just go. Trying to dig through their shit uh, that isn't busted up, right? Let's see what you got for other stuff. Okay, now we've got better stuff than what you got uh, saleable here, buddy. Oh, actually, wait. Let's cash in our our worthless crap, right? 135 G's, 120 G's, nearly a thousand airs here. No, no, I don't want to talk to the kid. I want to talk to the mom. There we go. Yeah, you, did you hear how pi fucking pumped your son is? He'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Let's have a look around, see if anybody else is jazzed as hell about this. People are like set on rebuilding here, right? Which hell, I guess nothing brings folks together like crisis, right? Good on them. Good on them, I suppose. Innovations and shit. Can I climb up and talk to everybody else? No. Okay. I guess we should save and be on our way then. We've done what we can do. Now we're ready to go. Unless... I don't want to go yet. Can we jump in and have a swim around and... Ah, oh, they don't let you. Boo! <laughs> Come on. Here I am trying to do the whole secrety secrets bit and they're not letting me. Let's go. Yep. Yeah. Let's go to the island in the northeast. Yeah, okay. Northeast. Got it. Oh, we get to actually control this too, huh? Oh, okay. So this is our expando overworld. Oh, can we go back to Evermist for a bit? Presumably our point of origin, right? Okay. Let's see what we can do down there. 
Before you make progress, always fucking uh, do other things, right? Oh no, we got a Solstice Shrine Island. Can we can we go ashore here? All right, no, not yet, but it's now on the map. This is cool. Can we go ashore here? No, that would have been a good secret. Alright, well, I don't remember seeing a port at uh, Mist Island or whatever. So, we might have trouble sailing back here, huh? Ah, tease. We're gonna have to get uh, the Sea of Stars equivalent to the Epoch before we can come back here. That stinks, because I want to come back here now. <laughs> now that we have access to it, I want to come back here now. Alright, well, I mean, it would behoove us to sail the seas a bit and see what we can see. Hey, look at this. What do we got? Still Pond Islands. That's good for uh No, I don't know. I want to I want to land here for a bit. <sighs> okay. Well, it's a fishing spot, right? They're not letting me make landfall anywhere but the place we're supposed to drop these people off at. I guess that makes sense, right? It's just like, yeah, do the fucking progression, do the story bits, do the narrative. But I want to do other things too. Like this, whatever this is. Watcher Island, yeah. Ah. Oh. Okay, can't do that. Some other things here. Hiker's Rest. Oh, it's, good. it's even highlighted with a fucking bang with a star around it, so that's important, I guess. Be important later. What else we got here? Mesa Island. Oh, that looks fancy. That looks fancy and cosmic and magical. It'll be fine, I'm sure. And the villagers on the ship are like, what the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> it's like, come on, no, let me let me sail the seas a bit. And see see what we can what we got going on here. Oh, I see a pattern underwater there. That's uh That's probably something, huh? Settlers Island. Okay, well we wanna go to Settlers Island. That that's the bit, but I don't wanna do that just yet. Let's see what else we have. It's probably another Solstice Shrine. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Oh, what's that? We got, like, some sort of undersea crater going on there. Oh, plus a stone go. Oh, four stone golems. Okay. Alright, I'm sure that's important later. It's probably the Dwellers or something. That's the in-game shit. Got here Basalt Island. Okay. Volcano. I guess that tracks. Oh, another little highlighted bit here. Oh, question mark. Okay. Floating ass island. Got it. Got it. And that's the world. The world as we know it. Except for that top right bit. That didn't highlight anything for some reason. sure that that's actually a thing and I didn't just miss the key map point or whatever. Seems awfully suspicious if this is the only bit of the map they won't reveal to me. Hmm. Okay, well... 
reason for that, I'm sure, but... Okay, fine, let's go drop these villagers off at their island. We're here. Brand new life. Brand new island. Let anyone here start building hovels. <laughs> Come on, Garl, you can't even say houses. Yeah. He's next. Get to it right now. He's gonna be the organizer here too, huh? Yeah. All right. Let them. Let them do that. Let them build their build up their shit. Look at that. It's already looking like a village. It isn't. But you know, keep at it. I'm sure they'll get something going before. The winter chill kills them all. Oh, oh geez, that's good, that's good, boom. It's a boom off screen. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> that's funny shit. Love it. Okay, all right, we got some shack-looking structures taking, taking shape here. It's no port of brisk, but it's a start. Nice, okay. What are they, what are they calling this new port town? New port brisk? Fort Brisk Nuevo. Oh, it only took him a few days, huh? Yeah, all right. That's how that works. That's the, the video game time for you. Cutting deeper into the island found a strange entrance. Did anyone hurt? No, he got out of there because it's fucking weird. Alright, let's go check it out. Oh, are we going on just without a third party member then? Are Sarai and Garl staying behind to do the thing? Yep, okay. Interesting. Interesting little bit. Like, I kind of dig how they're doing the party management stuff, honestly. Experience all kinds of things. You know what? But first, let's go fishing. Catch the, I'm gonna guess, like, two different kinds here? Yeah, the two kinds we don't have. The two very fish-looking kinds are going to be impossible to tell apart, but all right. Oh, all right, whatever. Doesn't matter if we catch an identical one, right? It just gives us more stuff. I guess we could release it, but eh, whatever. Eh? Oh, there we go. That's one of the ones we're looking for. Yeah, it looks like a fucking... Fish have a chin? <laughs> Alright, what's the other one look like now, though? It was kind of smaller-ish. Oh, ooh, it's a fighter. It's a fighter. Sure, it does not want to be caught. Tough fucking shit, though. Yoink. Come here, you. Fucking come here. Don't, don't, don't prolong this. Don't delay the inevitable. Wow, it is really fighting. There we go. Crimson bass. Crimson bass, sorry. It's a fish, not a, not an instrument. <laughs> Okay, that was the uh, that was the two, right? Yep. Okay. Good job. 
Uh, no. Let's see if there's another chest or crafting materials or whatever foodstuffs back here. Feels like there should be. Eh? Uh -huh. Eh? Yeah. Ah, that would have been such a good spot for it. Maybe there's something behind the waterfalls, though. Yeah? Ah, no! Fucking... Missed opportunities. All the way around. Oh, well. What are you gonna do? Alright, enough fucking around, I guess. Let's go check out this weird, eerie cave that they found. Oh, it's a crypt. Oh, yeah, that's eerie. That's eerie for sure. Huge, but not evil. Yeah, that's okay, too. Oh, okay, weird magic thing. Weird clay pot. I don't know what the fuck that even looks like, actually. The Crypt. Oh boy, aptly named. Fucking Lantern. He's Crypt Walker, naturally. Okay. Fire went on. It's a bit chilling to greet visitors. The sun one. Mind giving you a little spark? Uh, sure, yeah. Why not? Here you go, buddy. Let's have some magic. I'm sure that won't end poorly. Whoa! Damn! Okay. All right, that's pretty cool. No, 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 I want to get the chest that was there first. No, 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 ah. Oh. You're having to commemorate. Uh, I don't know, do we have, know anybody worth commemorating? We're just here to invest a Mac tier. Don't, don't, don't worry. <laughs> Technically, it is not. Do people come to live near the crypt then? I mean, sure. I mean, it's a little bit, it's a bit of a hike to the south, but... They're sort of nearby. Thousands of stone statues and monuments dedicated to the memory of the early builders and visionaries. Okay. You mean thousands. I mean, I see at best a hundred in this room, but you know, whatever. See the place in its monuments in your convenience. The piece you're looking for and have its coordinates, we have to show you to it. Just share this script is entirely neutral and optional. <laughs> All right, so the, the in universe gallery. I got it. I got it. Cool. So artifacts, mementos, etc. I suppose, huh? Whoa, 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 whoa! What was that? Oh, holy shit! What is this? Oh, is this the fucking? Is this the Kickstarter backer room stuff? Maybe. I think that's what we stumbled upon here. If so, that's fucking cool. Like, what a great in-universe thing to do it with, you know? That's gonna be my guess at any rate. Man, I wish I knew that there was a Kickstarter for this. I would have fucking totally thrown in a few buckos. <laughs> this is so cool. I like it. This is really fucking cool. This is way better. I, okay, not to cast dispersions on you know, games and projects to do the whole credits roll for Kickstarter backers or whatever. This is this is cool. This is a lot better, I'm gonna say. I guess hence why they said yes, there are thousands. <laughs> Ah, uh, this is so good. So fucking good. Oh, this is really a big area, huh? Hot damn. Alright, how the hell do we get out of here, though? <laughs> how do we get out of here? Like, I feel like it's... I hope there's a way to get out of here. Like, as cool as this is, clearly, but does one return to the game? God, this goes on forever. 
Okay. Um, how the hell did we even get in here to begin with? Oh, there we go. Ah! Holy shit. That's a big-ass area for all that. Okay. Uh, hence why he's, he was saying, like, if you want to find something specific, you know, whatever. Uh... <laughs> Ah, uh, super cool. Who's at 900 thou? Anybody? Nobody. Nobody's at 900 thou. Oh, that's super... That's a great implementation of that. I like it. That's why it's entirely optional, right? Oh, that's super, so good, though. All right, where on the map is that? Okay, that's all the way up here. Oh, that's cool. I have to poke around that a little bit more just for grinsies. In a couple sessions or so or whatever. But hey, whoa, look at how fucking great they made their houses and shit while we were gone for like 10 minutes. Pretty impressive work. Very old crypts. I mean, let's not read into the fact that it's a, a crypt for dead people and they got the Kickstarter backers in there. That's not try to draw any conclusions there, but that's pretty cool. It's a good way to go about it. Completely safe up north. Don't worry about it. Everything's fine. Name the town. Oh, they... They fucking named it by dropping names into a hat or a bag or whatever. That seems like not the best way to name something like a town, but hey, whatever. Had to reuse Garl's animation for something, right? Newport Brisk! <laughs> oh no, Garl. What is it? Wait, what? I'm sorry. Excuse me? They're naming it Garl? That's actually kind of funny. I like it. <laughs> the town of Garl. Hell yeah. I mean, he kind of deserves it. Like, fucking hell yeah, man. No, just call it Garl. This is fucking... It doesn't need another name. Let's just call it the fucking town of Garl. Or Port of Garl, or whatever the fuck. Ah. Uh, that's funny as hell. Hope? We gonna call it Hope? The Town of Hope or something? Joy? Eh, two on the nose. Okay. Yeah, alright. What else do we got? A beginning, positive outlook. Okay. Like, honestly, naming something is the hardest bit of anything, really. Like, I don't... I don't... I don't blame them for having problems. Mirth? Town of Mirth? Okay. okay. I mean, that tracks. I suppose, happiness and shit, right? I guess it works. It, the, calling it a town of Garl would be perfect too, honestly. <laughs> it would honestly be better, but okay, fine, whatever. Town of Mirth. Got it. Got it. Fucking got it. Like, when are the other pirates gonna get wise to the captain's thing, though? I feel like they would eventually figure it out. Oh old man is here to see us. Oh, is it the fucking headmaster? Is he done, uh, meditating on what we're supposed to do about the two turncoats? Two shitheads, Zerlina and Brewgrave. Brewgave. Not an extra R in there. Brewgave. Layholes. Traitors. Just arrived at the port. Oh no, here he is. He's uh, getting his steps in, so he's up here to see us now. Hey, look at this. We made a fucking town. What do you think, huh? Pretty 
research and racking your brain. Okay. Uh-huh. And? What did you figure out, buddy? Oh, bad news. Oh, great. Perfect. Uh, the numbers to fight the Dweller are strike. Are you fucking serious? We got an entire town. They'd fucking back us up, wouldn't they? Probably. Miracle we need exists. It's not documented. Well, of course. Like, miracles are not documented. Give me a break. And you won't be joining us. Well, of course not. You're fucking old, man. You could barely hold it together for the fight against the Dweller of Woe. You think you're gonna fucking help us against the Dweller of Strife? Get out of here. Immeasurable power. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Thunder Eclipse stands impervious even now imagining there won't be one before it is done gathering its power. Well, that seems bad. I'll throw everything away. and back in order is in its prime. I'll not take any more from you. Well, what are you going to do about it, though, brody? buddy here? Huh? You said you won't be joining us, so what the fuck are you going to do? You resi You're going to give up? Wow, you fucking coward. What the hell? What is this deal here? So go and get stuff and you're just fucking done. Alright. Whatever. Sure, I guess it's a young person's game from here on out, huh? Good gravy. I mean, I guess he's not wrong. Like, he's probably seen some shit. He's probably seen some shit, so if he wants to live, he should live. Mesa Island. Okay, well, that's the one fa uh, surrounded by the weird cosmic barrier thing, right? Yeah, it makes me want to be a challenge with the help of its guardian. We're lucky to still have extol and yeet. Ah, I get it. <laughs> that was the thing what which threw us from the mist island to the island that has brisk on it, right? Incredible. I mean, sort of, but yeah. <laughs> okay. Fucking great meme. Um, yeah, it's not a challenge, but to sleep with flesh magic. Oh, yeah, it's gonna learn to remove the magic barrier, blah, 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 blah. Not a curse we can break. Oh, really? Well, we're not gonna fucking just give up like that. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. Let's get there. Like, we've got the spirit of youth and also Garl, so, you know, whatever. Might be someone who does. So they like, who? I'm really giving up, not my faith in you, huh? Is your final gift for me? The Coral Hammer. <clears throat> Alright, that's that's cool. What does it do? Watcher Island, or Lost City of Dakari lines in the waves of Blue Lake. Blue Lake. Okay. The bell with the Coral Hammer, and they will know you were sent by a friend. The audience at the temple, and maybe it's the Oracle of Tides. Okay. Alright. Hey, you really ought to visit. Ooh, excuse me, ever missed island again, but how? We can't get there. We, there wasn't a dock for the ship and shit, so... Alright, cool. Get a key, we get a hammer. Can we take your sick-ass moon staff with us, too? Feels like that would be helpful. Stay here in Mirth, huh? Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, this brand new ass town we just built here. Just fucking stay here. Missing an official town elder. And as the oldest fucker here, guess who qualifies? Uh. Incredible. Alright. <laughs> Excellent. See, Garl knows what to do. Like, really? You're just gonna leave your shit there? Like, no littering, buddy. Come on. I guess we go to Watcher Island, or we go back to Evermist, right? So we could... Whatever. No, let's go back to Evermist. Like, going to Watcher Island feels like the, the path of progress. Let's not do that. Also, who's this guy? Gerard the Construction... <sighs> I fucking get it. <laughs> I get it! Fucking great. Okay. Well, that was easy enough. I'm going to need some plans. Finding my... Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, sure. Sure, we'll take the path of, we'll take the path of completion, Gerard the constructionist. Oh my god. <laughs> uh it's funny as hell. Alright. Um Well, let's take a poke around the buildings here first, I suppose, right? A lot of work to be done, yada yada yada. I'm glad I moved in the piney air. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Oh, there a break. Yeah, I mean, they built this place in what, three days? Four days, maybe? Oh, oh, okay, that's the exit up top. Got it. Fucking got it. No, oh, there's not really anything up here, up here, though. Oh, except for that. There we go. Secrets all the way around. Mundane tasks, yada yada yada. Looking for the next steps. Uh, Crypt north of town. It is really impressive. Honestly. Almost everything's good to be starting anew. Okay, doors locked. Uh, town elder, blah 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 blah. Yep. Doors locked, doors locked. Purpose, yada yada yada. Doors locked. Alright, they really just don't want you pillaging their shit, apparently. You know, I can get behind. Alright, so... Moraine's house is gonna be there. We'll come back later. Favorite color of the animals. You have a lot of friends. Do your favorite food? <laughs> kids. Old Celsus story. He's also a master of something. Yeah, we knew that. Like, what the fuck? What do you take us for? Alright. Pop a quick save. And we'll see. If there's a save point right away on Evermist, we'll go there and call it a night. Oh, wait, there's a. Can we jump off there? Oh, we can. There's gotta be a secret around here somewhere, right? Wouldn't just let you jump and swim into the water if there wasn't something around here, right? Take a look. Eh? Oh, that would have been a good place for one. disappointed that there isn't a secret down here. Oh, maybe there is. Over there? Can we go over there? Nah. Boo. Nope. Okay. I just let you jump in and swim around for grins, I guess. Alright, yep. Yeah, let's set sail. Oh, and we get... <laughs> cool. Sarai gets the fucking... Cool ass attack by summoning some cannons and shit. Okay, I'm into that. That's the good stuff. Ah, and then here's the, the story break, right? You know what? That's pretty good. Pretty good timing for all that, honestly. Got the town of Mirth. We beat the shit out of an old ghost pirate captain wind mage thing. There's Ale Garland Sarice at sail for the Watcher Island, yada yada yada, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Clearly, that's the next progress thing, which we're not gonna do right away, but we'll go to Evermist. Go to Evermist first. Yeah, look at that. Just lets us go. Now, wherever we wanna go, I suppose. Okay. That's not gonna complain at us about. Oh no, we should go go up to the island in the northeast first, idiot. I'm like no, I don't want to do that. There's Wraith Island. Can we just go to Wraith Island whenever we damn well please too? Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Said something about a shrine and shit too. Got the key for it. Maybe it's not that one though. I feel like there's not gonna be a dock down here though, so I feel like we'll have to find the 
other thing that winds up and tosses his back here, pretty much, right? There's no, like, pier or dock or... Damn it. Unless we can sail into there. No, we can't do that. But hey, there's the thing there, right? So maybe if we go to Watcher Island, maybe the other throw thingy will be there. So where's Watcher Island, then? There. Oh, it's highlighted, dipshit, <laughs> on the map. Okay, but that I mean, feels like progress, and we've done a fair amount of progress already tonight. So can we just go like that? Quit out the title and call it there for the evening. Uh, okay, so that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be tomorrow, 7.30 p.m. CDT. It'll be Shmup Book Club. So we've got more Pistol Diamond Oboken and Blue Revolver and Death Smiles on the docket for tomorrow. Friday, Saturday, we're off. And then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT. It'll be long play. Uh, we'll go back to some Curse to Golf. Give a, another try at the remix mode and see if we can get past hole three. That would be fun. It would be a third of the way there. Um, oh, we do have a normal run to finish up there first, though. We can do that. We can do that first and then do the remix stuff. That should be fine. And then next Monday, 7 p.m. CDT, we'll be back with Sea of Stars, since we still have plenty of this to go, I have a feeling. Good old extended length RPG. This is fun, though. Like, this is super cool. Good design, lots of callbacks to other great RPGs. I'm into it. I'm into it super hard. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.